Hello and welcome back to the 60 Second Zoology series. My name's Amy, I'm a zoologist, and for episode six, we're getting up close and personal with anemone nematocysts. Sea anemones belong to a family called the Nidarians, a name which derives from the Greek word for nettle. This is owing to their specialized stinging cells called nematocysts, which can be found on their tentacles. When a tentacle is touched, a sensory hair called the nidocil is pulled, which triggers a chain of events inside the nematocyst cell. The first thing that happens is calcium ions within the nematocyst cell get released. This results in an increase in osmotic pressure within the cell. Simply put, when the calcium ions get released, water from surrounding tissues moves into the nematocyst cell, increasing the pressure inside. This pressure forces a barb inside the cell to be pushed up and out so it's fully extended, though still attached to the cell by a thread. The barb becomes inserted into the prey like a harpoon and can be very painful depending on the nadarian that's stinging. For example, a box jellyfish has been known to kill humans when they've been stung at sea as a result from shock or heart failure from the pain. Thankfully, the anemones in Cornish rock pools won't harm you if you do happen to brush your hand over them.